Come with me. Come with me, you little thing. I'm gonna go one more time out here. Because while I'm doing this, it's doing a grid line of the hallway, so next time I film in here, it won't take as long. What I'm gonna, I'm yeah, just getting away from the we music. Can, we could probably find a room that has a good, a good white, big white wall or something for you that you could. Uh, well, that's what I'm gonna do right now, it. actually. I'm gonna pull it over to this wall, over here. Okay, and then I'm gonna turn it around, and I'll grab that hinge here. So cool, man. Yeah, that's pretty wild. Holy. And now we'll put it on that wall. My, uh, it's not a light wall, but still. Right, so yeah, I'm right the here. Great, the great ginger black block in the background shows up really well, man. Mm -hmm. And there, as I was telling Derek how we could just, I could in a matter of a minute show how to size the water service, the water service is right here from the curb cock, right here to the building shutoff, and that is 12 meters long. So you use the 12 meters developed length, then you use the total fixture unit load of the building, which I've already figured out is 104.9 fixture units. And then the last thing is you just need the elevation difference from the water service to the main shutoff, which is 3 meters, and every meter is worth 10 kPa. So you go over here to the water main, this is 550 kPa, you subtract the 30 kPa from here, and the new elevated pressure will be 520 instead of 550 here. So you use the 520, and you go to this chart here, which is over 413, because ours is 520, so this is the chart we use. The developed length was 12 meters, so if I put my finger up, see 12 meters on the top there? So you use that 12 meter one, that's the developed length. And our load was 104.9 fixture units, so you just scroll down to a number bigger, which is 151, and voila, that is the size of the service, inch and a half. So that means this service, from the curb cock to the building shutoff, will be an inch and a half pipe. And that's how so you, you size, size all the pipes. That's how you size the pipe. And instead of, uh, instead of you, or them guys watching the video you know you, you do that in the class and then it's like yeah. you know instant feedback and questions really and like, stuff. Even, like i've never i've never even entertained how water lines get sized for buildings like that so like mm -hmm. i mean i'm not a simpleton i understand pressure and typing and like so i'm not a newbie but neither of course your plumbers like the way you showed me that i'm like i would I would 100% if you're like, okay, now do the assignment just on that one minute explanation, mm -hmm. I'd, be, I'm, I'd be fine. I'd be like, okay, count the fixtures, count the pressure, do the math, go to the chart, boom, inch and a half. Like, I learned it that fast now. We go into more detail because then there's also tables that tell you what the separate fixture unit loads of all these fixtures are. That's how I came up with 104.9. Like, for instance, I had to add 2.5 because of this little hose bib right here that is for the lawn in the front. That's why I added that one. Anyhow, it's 104.9. And how do you know what these fixture units are? Well, the table is on each floor here. So if I look here, this is the table I look at in the code book that tells me all the fixture unit loads. So, so there is the water closet, six walk right in there, yeah. liter per flush. It's 2.2 .2 fixture units. So that's what this is. These two toilets, these two toilets, they're all six liter per flush. They are worth 2.2 fixture units. That's how you add them up. Hold on, Fred. Just like I just want to explain. So, Derek, like when to Fred for Fred to zoom in on that table in there, he actually had to physically stick his head in there, like yeah, yeah. actually like, stick yeah. his neck out like a giraffe and look at the thing, right? That's just yeah. it's crazy, man. Yeah, that's... I wonder how the the safety ambassadors are probably. You're probably calling call the uh, psychology services. Hey, we got this guy over here. He's talking to the wall. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's people walking by thinking I'm uh, crazy. <laughs>